Hello friends. Welcome to our channel Instrument Calibration. In previous video, you have learned about proportional, integral, and derivative controller. If you are new on this channel, and if you have missed that video, you can find link in the description box. And if you do not want to miss any informative video in future, then please subscribe this channel, and press bell icon to get notification when we post new video on the channel. In this video, I am going to explain different methods to measure analog output current of transmitter. There are two different methods to measure 4 to 20 mA output of transmitter. In first method, we need to connect ammeter or multimeter in series with transmitter, to measure analog output of transmitter. In second method, we need to connect ammeter probe between negative terminal and test terminal of transmitter. However, this method can only be used, if transmitter has test port. In other words, if transmitter does not have third port or test port, then we need to use first method in order to measure analog output. So, let's go to first method. In first method, we need to connect multimeter in series with transmitter. As you can see from the diagram, put multimeter in current measuring mode. To put multimeter in current measuring mode, connect red probe to 400 mA port, and black probe to common port of multimeter. Now, rotate the knob of multimeter in clockwise direction, and select mA function. After this, press yellow button at once to select mA DC function. Analog current output can be measured in DC form. So, it is important to select mA DC function. Once you have put multimeter in current measuring mode, connect red probe to negative terminal of transmitter, and common probe to negative terminal of 24 volt DC power supply. Now, multimeter in series with transmitter. So it will show 4 mA in normal condition. And analog current value keep increasing, when measured value increases. In this method, we need to connect multimeter probe to negative terminal and test terminal of transmitter. As you can see from the diagram, this method is only applicable for transmitter, which has test port. In order to measure output current, we need to connect red probe to negative terminal of transmitter, and common or black probe to test terminal. After connecting probe to negative and test terminals, put the multimeter to current measuring mode and select mA DC function of multimeter. Once you select mA DC from multimeter, multimeter will show mA output of transmitter. Thank you friends for watching this video. I hope you like this video. If you have any questions about this video, please ask your questions in comment box. And if you need PDF version of this video, then please let me know in comment box. And if you think our content is informative for you, then please like and share this video with your friends.